Out of the Model 3 and the Model Y here, what's your favorite? You know what? <laughs> now that I look at the Model 3, I kind of like the Y. Maybe you should put your, your glasses. There you go. <laughs> oh my god, is this a Kia? <laughs> As soon as you walked into the MNS booth, man, that's the first thing that caught my eye. And it's funny because I've been standing here for like a good 30 minutes and everybody that walks by, you know, stop by and take a picture because it's just different from any other Kia. It is. To say that there's going to be a faster version coming, which is the EV6 GT mm -hmm. with all, almost 600 horsepower is pretty and is nuts. Yeah. What's your opinion? The Batman wing. Batman wing. <laughs> <laughs> that literally looks like a Batman wing from here. What I like about it especially is the split, the slit that they have over here in the middle. And this is what I was talking about. See this little pattern right here? Yeah, yeah. It matches. Oh man. Yeah, little accents like that. That what, was it done on purpose or accident? I... Was this done in purpose or accidentally? Because it literally matches the pattern that it you guys It is on here. purpose, actually. And this is a prototype. Okay. Uh, the spoiler is going to be in carbon fiber. Uh, matte carbon fiber, actually. Yeah, it's a match. Like that. the one in the, the diffuser <laughs> and on the trunk cover. Wow. These little details, man. That's part of the car, but it comes silver. Oh, okay. And they actually wrapped it black. Oh, okay. um, so it looks significantly better. I had plastic dipped it and it didn't look as good, but yeah. it was fine. Yeah. That's that's also factory, but that does come black. It's factory? On this, on the wind package, yeah. On the yeah, GT the, line, you don't get this. You get the colored panel to match the rest. The, with the grooves on it, these grooves? Yeah, it's factory, yeah. A lot of people don't like it because in pictures, it makes it look like this is a gap. Oh, yeah. Um, well, it looks like the wheel gap is really big, but from certain angles, you can see it and it looks really good, so. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah, that looks like there's a massive gap, yeah. Beautiful car, isn't it? What do you think about the front? The front is aggressive. The body could make the front looks a lot more aggressive. I like this piece over here. With a carbon weave on it. Uh, the double splitter. Yeah. The carbon fabric in the matter. Is this going to be a carbon? Do you know if they're going to make a carbon? I don't think they're making that? that one. The bottom splitter can't, yeah. is not going to be in carbon, right? It is not. It's actually made in full mix material. Okay. So it will remain as full mix. Just the front lip will be uh, carbon fiber. Okay. But the front end looks amazing. Yeah. And then the car, the way it looks, it doesn't look look like an SUV. It looks actually like a wagon. Yeah, it doesn't give me an SUV vibe. It gives me like a wagon vibe. My license plate is literally a wagon. My, yeah, your, your, your it's, actual yeah my yeah. actual plate. It says wow. a wagon. It, oh man, the side skirt, the crown effect just makes makes it looks everything better. It makes it like they say makes all you know a good body kit always make car less boring. Yep, hundred percent. So yeah, yeah, man. From from what I'm seeing so far, the build look amazing. Yeah. So from what I've seen. So what's your opinion on uh, moving to EV at some point? Um, what's it gonna take for you to move to EV? You know there's good EVs out there, but um, the reason why I like combustion engine is because of the noise. The noise. The sound. Yeah. So if I get an EV, it will have to be like another car added to my collection, but not move completely from EV and then you know remove all my you know combustion engine yeah. cars. So if I'm getting any EV, it's going to be in addition to what I yeah. have. Not to remove anything from my fleet. I think a lot of people would agree with that because yeah. that's exactly my thing. I have two other combustion engine right. yeah. cars. Yeah. And then that screen? Oh man. <laughs> yeah. Can you open it? Yeah, yeah. Oh, you can just do that. Oh man. Now all the new Kias have that screen now though. Oh yeah. The, the Telluride's yeah. getting it, yeah, yeah. the Sorrento's getting it. Um, this thing I never got it. And it's still being discontinued. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they put that in there. Actually, I didn't get a picture of that. It smells like cleaning supplies. Yeah, Feel free to move the seat back. Yeah, because that's a giant sitting. <laughs>
So do they make one with a sunroof or no? They do. The GT line comes with a sunroof. Okay. Oh my the, God. The GT line has LED lighting all across this panel. Okay. All on the doors. It's all LEDs. Even this is all LED lighting. Really? So it looks like Tron up in that thing. And it was that a wireless charger? That's a wireless charger, yeah. I think the car has to be on. But If, if you can fit my phone with a case, it can fit any phone. Yeah. He has a Note. Uh, this is S22 a S22 Ultra. Ultra, Ultra yeah. Yeah. If you can fit any phone, my phone will fit any phone. Wow, and the seats are comfortable too. And then he has a lot of headroom. I'm 6'4". 6'4". Six, four. Six, four. Yeah, and I fit with a lot of headroom. My knee room, that thing is still backing up. See, my my legs are yeah. straight. Yeah. So if you are 6'4", and then debating if you can fit on the EV6, this is my headroom, plenty. Yeah. And this is my leg room, nice and stretched. That's a beautiful car, man. That's yeah. a gorgeous car. I can see myself driving this on a nice road trip. Yeah, on a daily, yeah. daily, what? Uh, sir, what the? <laughs> we are too close to our comfort. <laughs> oh my God. We in trouble. Oh, man. And you only had 11,000 miles on it. Yeah. So the car is fairly new. Yeah, I haven't driven too much. Have you taken it any road trip or anything? Yeah, I bought it in Green Bay. Okay. And then I drove it to Dallas. Okay. Um, that was my first time ever being oh, in an yeah. EV. Uh, oh, Green Bay, uh, Wisconsin, Wisconsin is where I bought yeah, it, yeah, 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 and then I drove down to Dallas home. I wow. took it to Houston when I saw you at the MS event okay. uh, yeah, 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 from yeah, yeah. Dallas to Houston. That's four hours, and then I dropped this car off with them uh, about three weeks ago in Houston okay. as well. So, multiple smaller road trips, yeah. but well, one big one. The, the big one. That was, was a big one, yeah, and that was in February when it was 12 degrees outside, Oof. and uh, it was a little nerve wracking. Okay, and it's all wheel drive, correct? This one's all wheel drive, yeah. Okay. You can get it in rear wheel drive, but the all wheel drive is the way to Look, go. I have the seats back up all the way. Oh and damn, he still seat. has all that room. Everything is still fit, and I have the seat back up all the way. <laughs> Dude, I, I like this. Yeah. I like this, yeah. Nice and spacey. Exactly. Nice and spacey, roomy, and comfortable.